What's going on you guys? It's Mr. Lombax bringing you another video. In this tutorial video, I'm going to be going over the GTA 5 game pack that's associated with the strike pack for mod century that Collective Minds has for us. Now, I'm going to say this. There is right now no dedicated game pack for the Chrono Zen. I repeat, there's nothing for the Chrono Zen as of right now. Though, there are user related and generated and made scripts available you guys can like search for them check the forums or just download them and and install them onto your device but as of right now there's no dedicated script or game pack for the corona zen right now that collective minds made will they add it in the future i'm pretty sure they will especially with the whole announcement that it will gta 5 will be coming to ps5 and with the whole um fourth of july update currently out now with all the sales and dlc content and stuff like that you guys wanted this video for the strike pack because you guys wanted me to show off and, and go off um, and explain what's available with this game pack. In this particular game pack, right here, as you can see it, my second slide, GTA 5 version 2.2.0. This is going in. Now, there, there's there's other mods that's in this game pack that's not here listed. Um, I'm going to be going over the most, I feel is most valuable and the most dopest that you guys should know. And the others are not really... I'm showing you guys that I'm going over stuff that I feel that I feel you guys are going to benefit the most from. I don't want to bring you guys, you know, BS and, you know, mods that's like, eh, and stuff that you guys don't are not interested in. Such as, I'm going to say right now, they have a mod that's um, for arm wrestling and a mod for for um, for golfing. Um, easy golf and easy um, arm wrestle, I believe. Stuff like that. Mods like that. If you guys are interested, I'll explain at the end of the video, but... Um, let's just, let's just, let's just go on with this game pack. As you can see, nothing like that is listed in this game pack because those mods are hidden within this game pack. And I'll just go over it with you guys right now. The ADS Anti Recall Plus Recorder. Now, about this. The recorder, to me, is, it's very frustrating and it's, it's a lot. If you guys want to dig deeper, you can. I'm um, going to the Mod Pass website, look at their website for the game pack details and read it and, and learn for yourself. But I, I bring you guys the most easiest, fastest, and best. You know ways possible for these game packs for these mods that i feel is more faster and beneficial to you guys stress-free so have it um aimed out sites enabled and then here you want to be coming here um the long way so every gun in gta is going to be different you're going to want to come here you know plug back in your strike pack and just adjust here you know positive and negative bring your guns up bring your gun down see high value decreases recoil so the higher you are the more it's going to decrease the recoil because it says right here uh, reduces recoil excuse me reduces recoil so and you know higher is going to bring it down and and the lower is going to bring it up that's how they have it here right higher value reduces the recoil so um the way the way the anti recoil mod works if if this in this game pack it works identical to like cod and stuff like that is is, is up and down so it's gonna the mod brings the gun down depending on your numbers and the mod is going to bring the gun up depending on how you know you the your numbers are so every gun in gta is going to have a different recoil pattern you're going to want to plug and play and test and just my advice to you write down and save and memorize uh, whatever number you have your settings to each gun just remember it to me unfortunately that, that's the best way i could say rather than the whole recorder but that's just me that's my opinion and i just want to bring you guys how i feel that i think is the most fastest beneficial way but to each his own like i always say just just test out the numbers for yourself test out the numbers for yourself and you guys will see Global mod, easy headshot. This mod is OP as heck. I'm gonna tell you, it's pretty. It's, it's not aimed by, um, but it kind of. Well, once you once you ADS and it, and it snaps onto your target for that quick second, it's gonna bring the camera up, enabling you to get a quick instant headshot. No matter what gun you're using, it's pretty dope. It's automatically gonna go to the head, and you can. I'm gonna show. I'm gonna show you guys um, on AI in the game. Auto run, swim, um, climb. Just have this on um, always active. So. All you gotta do is just move the, the left hand off stick and your character is gonna sprint forever. Smart armor. This is pretty good too. I'm gonna show you guys in game of how to activate and stuff like that. Um, you just wanna have it here, like heavy, standard, super heavy, whatever. You can always change it. I'm gonna show you how to purchase and change it in game as well, um, how to set it up. There's one way of um, setting up this mod to recognize, you know, um, which, which, uh, which armor to apply, which is pretty dope. So let's say you want to change, let's say you run a super light, but then you want to change it in a mission or change it next time to super heavy. You can, it's not locked to like one armor. And then here, the turbo face, the turbo button mod was associated with the left paddle. You just want to bring it all the way down. Just bring it all the way to 20. You look, the lower, the faster. So bring that bit, bring it all the way to 20. The higher, the more slow it's going to be. So why? I mean, you want things to be fast, right? Bring that bit all the way down to 20. Now this is a short game pack. 
as you can see very short these are just the basic mods but like i said there's stuff hidden behind behind this mod um some are useful some are not i'm going to go over the ones i feel is most beneficial and useful um that's not showing here but you can also use that's associated with this game pack but not everything because i feel like you know the arm wrestling thing and the and uh and the golfing i don't know about that but let's go on with the gameplay Hi you guys, jumping straight into the gameplay, showing you guys this game pack. First thing you really want to do is go into mod pass mode. Well, I like to go mod pass mode. If your eyes are white, hold that small left black button on the left side of the straight pack, press that right paddle. Eyes are flashing white and blue. I'm on the first slot. The way you navigate, hold it again and press the right paddle. I'm on my second. That's my GTA is on the second, right? So now first mod, if I move, you see the auto the automatically sprints there. It's a mod, it automatically sprints for you. And that's it. You don't, I don't gotta continuously tap X. See, another thing you can do, uh, another mod actually that you can use also for like auto auto running and stuff like that, is also mm, pretty much Turbo 2.0. It's a turbo. It's a turbo for a turbo mod for this game pack, which is associated with the left paddle. So you want to hold the left paddle, and any one of these face buttons, all you gotta do is hold it, and it'll continuously spam it for you as long as you hold down that left paddle same thing any one of these four buttons there's only these four buttons unfortunately but hold that paddle i'm holding square now while i'm running holding square as you can see instead of me keep pressing square to jump it's leaping holding circle it's going to continue continuously melee and i'm holding down that left paddle it's pretty effing dope now next mod i want to go over is the ads anti-recoil like i explained in the beginning of the video pretty much i'm gonna go over it real quick again my advice to you guys the best way fastest way is just you just jot down write down the the number of settings for each gun every gun every weapon in this game is gonna be is gonna have a different recoil pattern just make sure you plug in your strike pack and, and you come here you test it out you plug your strike pack to pc and you save the numbers to each gun write it down if you have to memorize it if you're good at remembering things each number so you already know you know the each gun is gonna have a different recoil pattern so for example i have this out special car by my ads at the wall that's not the real um that's not the real recoil of it it's because as you saw i had it on 25 which you just play around with it um at this point i will unplug my straight pack test out another number maybe i'll go a little less maybe i'll go a little more up and to test it out to see you know to pretty much where where it'll be steady where it'll be at you know perfect you guys know but that's my advice to you guys um just stay away from the recorder but to each his own. If you like doing the recorder, just just do research. It's it's and look it up. Go on my pass on their my pass uh, website. It's very tricky. It's very hard. It's a lot of things you gotta do. A lot of button sequences. But like I said, I bring you guys the most fastest, convenient way. And you know, unfortunately, it's this way. But all you guys should be used to it. All my OGs, you know, from COD and stuff like that, messing with anti record numbers and stuff like that. So that shouldn't be an issue for you guys. Now moving on to the next mod. The next mod I'm going to be going over with you guys is a smart armor. Um, smart armor is pretty dope. It's pretty dope. Now there's two ways. Excuse you. No. There's two ways. First, I'm going to show you um, that we are, I already have selected the heavy armor. So if you have, if you're like me, you have always rock heavy armor. You're just going to want to hold the. You're going to want to hold the right paddle and tap down. Control is going to vibrate. Just let it do its thing. It's going to select, purchase, and equip for you. Boom. It's that simple. That simple. And you're good to go just do that every time now if you want to change your armor let's say you want to run light armor light armor or whatever you would hold the right paddle right and double tap down the d-pad this time instead of pressing it once you double tap it wait it's going to do a sequence it's going to stop right here then at this point you could select let's say standard armor it's going to vibrate it's going to remember it now it's saved now if i were to hold the right d-pad and press down again once it's going to attempt to select the, the standard armor again so that's how you switch it again right d-pad down down let me go back to my uh, heavy armor boom and there you go it's just remembering um the how many the, the down sequences of how many times you you press down on the list and selecting it that's it and then the mod just um purchases it and equips it for you it's pretty dope mod very fast very convenient next mod all right, you guys, check this out. The next mod is going to be what I actually just called the Rapid Fire um, RPG mod. When you have a rocket launcher, um, even a lock on, whatever RPG, whatever. This is just, it's like um, Cancel Reload, pretty much. It's going to cancel the, anima anim the long ass animation of putting another rocket in. It's already uh, automatically set. Like I said, this is one of the mods that, that's behind the curtains, if you will. It's like hidden away from, from in, within the game pack. 
I'm sure you guys how I go about when you're ADSing, when you're holding down that L2, you want to hold the left the left paddle. So hold down L2, hold the left paddle, and shoot. Now when you're doing that, see it's gonna cancel and do it again. It's canceling the animation. It's a glitch pretty much. When you shoot, you you pull out, it's pretty much just pulling out the um the Molotov for you, like a Molotov, and then it's going back, and then you're able to, to shoot faster like that, instead of just waiting for the whole reload animation. Which is pretty dope. It's pretty dope in my opinion. I mean, it's fun. Not for everybody. Not for everybody. But I gotta show it off regardless. <laughs> Next mod. This is pretty much convenient. This is convenient. This is easy passive for those of you who just want to get into passive mode as quickly as possible. You want to hold the right paddle and just press up. Boom. You're in passive mode. <laughs> That's it. Next mod. Now, you guys, I'm already kind of um, in trouble with the law because uh, you see these people did. I was trying out the... Uh, the easy headshot mod it's pretty dope it's pretty godly it's pretty op it allows you to snap onto the head quickly as possible just to get easy headshot kills just like this boom as you can see that copper boom dead they all it uses ads and it automatically like aims to the head it's pretty op i mean obviously you just like come on come on, come on like kid. oh video oh i'm dead all right you ADS, boom. Simple as that. And this is, you don't even got to empty out a full clip like you would normally do without this mod. I mean, one bullet is all it takes straight to the head. Once you ADS, you can see, you see what it does? It just jolts up. It just jolts up like that. Because it's like, the way you snap onto the target and it just goes up. Straight to the head. Boom. Pretty OP. God mod. Um, I say that's the best mod. That's what I say for last. I, I guess that's the best mod for this game pack for GTA. So if this video helped you out, and I know I didn't go over everything, like I said, um, there's other um, hidden behind the current mods that I don't feel are like um, worth me going over because who, who arm wrestles and who plays golf? I mean, if you guys, if that's your thing, I mean, feel free. Maybe someone in the comments can help you out or DM me if I get to you. Yeah, millions upon millions of uh, DMs and a lot of unanswered ones that I'm, I'm really trying to, you know, to help everybody and, and catch up. But anyway. Yeah, you could just go to their uh, my past website and read their game pack and read more about it so uh if that's your thing but uh, yeah hope this video helped you out if it did drop a like subscribe if you are new check out my other content it's been your boy mr long back stay safe everybody and i'm out peace hey guys if you're looking to get your own stripe pack chronos max plus chronos Zen, or anything off of the collective my store be sure to save yourself 10 percent off by using my special code mr long at checkout or simply clicking the link that's in the description of this video